big bits happening today, Stora Army. Big, big bits. We are attempting this week to re-modify this whole entire area. Look at it, it's absolutely covered in trash. Strong potential to be a good spot. Uh, we're gonna clean up the whole area and potentially gonna turn this kind of like non-spot in Brighton into a proper, proper spot. This is the beautiful ironwork structure of the Madeira Terrace, occupying nearly half a mile of Brighton's world famous seafront. All right, coming down. It has been closed to the public since 2012, as the structure has been degraded by the marine environment and became unsafe. There's so much broken glass down here, look at this. The rubbish has been thrown over the fence, the yeah. weeds are growing, it looks terribly sad. See all this rubbish over here? We're going to sweep it up, get rid of all the glass. About time the council did that. So we're going to make it look a lot tidier, I'll tell you that for free. Yeah, no, that's very kind of you. Any wise words to say to the video? General? That which you seek is inside of you. Oh, appreciate well. that. Thank nice you. to meet you, sir. Okay. <laughs> in recent years, we've started modifying spots in little ways to open up challenges and just make them kind of more interesting for the community to use. But at the back of our head, we've always wanted to kind of build something proper, turn something that is essentially unusable into a space full of challenges and. We thought at first that it would be a bit too bait to build anything there. But then we kind of thought, worst case, it gets ripped down by the council. Best case, we get a couple months of good training at a spot that really feels like ours. Some of the materials we managed to scavenge from skips and stuff was a bit too heavy for us to carry down or lower. So we, uh, we got up our gravity into help for those ones. <laughs> So this is day number two of Sui 2, the rebirth of this crazy space that's been neglected by the council for 10 years, says Callum. So what our idea is to come here, make the unsafe bit safe so we can jump on, grow the spot, clear away all the duttiness, and then create this whole new space for people to enjoy. Turn a dead space into a space that's alive. Yeah. Don't charge anybody money. Free, easy, yeah. fun for everyone. It's only a good thing. But at the moment, we've got to get rid of all this kind of... The amount of glass at this spot. Needles and like other bits of crack pipes and... Oh. They wouldn't want to inhale that dust. This is what we've all sweeped up the other night, like all into a big pile. I think oh, a little, little like a slow cooker in there. Slow cooker. You could make like a beef stew in that. Yeah. Loads of lighters, loads of vapes. The, the amount of elf bars, like Jesus Christ. There's been promises of like regeneration projects and everything, but. It looks like we're gonna just have to take things into our own hands and there's an official sport and still there's no bloody funding. There's no parkour parks in the UK. So taking things into our own hands and doing it ourselves. Before any of the building was actually gonna start, we had to just clean up the area. So it was back to good old laboring days. Broomsticks out, sort the gap out. So going, going well then. Yes, <laughs> I'll be back in another 20 minutes, see how you're getting on. It felt quite cool to just kind of scour up and down looking for little bits of wood or links or bars and imagine how it would be used. Some of the stuff we couldn't even think of a use for when we found it. Dude, you might have some f***ing use. Oh, this is how organised our plans are at this stage. <laughs> yeah, make something like that. On day two it kind of dawned on us how big the job was going to be and how much more scrap wood we were going to have to find to build this thing. We're going to need a lot of wood, yeah. Listen, I know what you're thinking. I'm thinking it too. Toby's husband material. Sorry, girls and boys. He's actually taken, so back off. Big progress was being made. All the troops were in, helping on the final bits, working hard in the British sunshine. Beautiful scenes. Granted, some people working a little bit harder than others. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying. Toothbrush. <laughs> All right, James, move out of the way. Max has got the proper tool. Oh, oh. That's way better. Oh, oh. oh it's good, it's good. Yes! <laughs> Make a major move.
solid. <laughs> That's so good. Clean. We've always laughed at the fact that inanimate objects like walls and, and lamp posts can give people like us hours and hours of joy and essentially like purpose in life. That something a builder assumes is going to have a single use is, is, is used for so, something so positive and so meaningful to us. So it was quite satisfying being on the other end of that, knowing that what we build is going to be used for parkour. Oh, perfect. That's what you wanted. <laughs> really? <laughs> Banging. Nice. <laughs> Can you get it through the gap, please? We got wood, boys. We got wood. Ooh. Scooters are the perfect thing for transporting wood. A couple of those, one of these, we've got that green new bar in. Look at the developments at this spot. We've got two support beams supporting that. Now that's safe to use. And then we've got this here. We've got two slanters, three boards here, three boards here. Ooh, it's shaping up nicely. MVP builder is obviously Bob the Builder. This is the big one, Stora Army. This new face box that is going in here is the, the one that essentially makes this top awning here safe and gives us our landing zone for our original wall run dream. It was actually drooping before this, this roof, so we've actually kind of lifted it back to its original level and supported it. We're actually doing it a service. We're not damaging it, we're literally repairing it. So most of this wood that we found is actually found down here. Just littered full of unused wood. Yeah, so this is where we've kind of sourced most of our wood. This has been the best find so far. There's loads of needles and glass and just shit and it's just like... It's a pretty poorly kept area to be honest. Like look at it, it's just trash everywhere. That come in handy. We're in Brighton man, the, the pier is over there. You come to Brighton and have a nice day out. And look. Why is this space not being kept better? Everywhere man, you just gotta be so careful. That's actually not even a joke. If you're ever in Brighton and want a fresh new fit, look, come down here. Cheers bro! Wait, wait for it. Oh, dog. The freshest lad in town. There's oh, actually a pair as well. A pair of them. Just saying. Just saying. It's Just building. There is a t-shirt here, but I don't even want to pick it up. That's pretty decent though. Dude, honestly, fire. Oh, that was so sketchy. No. Oh. <laughs> Science. Oh, are oh, you going on your own? <laughs> this is the weirdest thing to watch. <laughs> we have our second beam in place. So yeah, we've got a face here. So we can arm jump 180 up and now we're going to turn this into a face. Oh, almost. Oh, we see. Okay, yeah, so. Thin swag, take your throne, lad. <laughs> nice little square box now. Supports this and opens up the face for arm jumps 180s. Come on, boys. This is a good day today. Really big progress. Like the main goal from the start was to open up this running 180 up to the top. You could maybe get pre to this side, you could maybe get arm jump and pre the other side. Can anyone do this from here? Run, run up to the top. Not 100% perfect, but for what we want, spot on. This is our sp spider's web set up in here. Big wedgie boy for like impact that way. Another wedgie boy for impact that way. Couple a few of them. I don't know if that should have been there. 
pretty happy with that. Supporting this roof now, so no chance we're gonna damage any of the original structure. And we've still not put one nail into the wall or the roof or anything else actually. It's all freestanding stuff essentially. Well satisfying. I love this shit. Trapped down by the rain. It's all in good. Cool. Bang a day though. Yeah, that's fast. This box being the I'm have to take a photo of that. <laughs> Here we are, that's doing pretty well. Final box. Look at that. We've just leveled the game up, boys. Why have we done that in the last <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Where were we you? We've got mate? this done in like 10 minutes. Oh, no. <laughs> It was hard to stop thinking of new ideas as we built more and more of the spot and in classic store fashion we totally underestimated how long it was going to take and how much work we were going to have to put into this thing. We think we guessed four or five days at first but after a few YouTube trips and filming projects we hit the four or five week mark and decided it was at least ready for a session so we got the community in and it was time to actually use this thing. Finally completed it. Congratulations. I've been hesitant to warm up in my head, there's always something else to do. You jumping at the bit to do a little bit more. I've wanted to do this for years. Yeah, it's weird it was sort of hiding under our nose yeah. for so long. Like, oh, we can just put boards on that. Four weeks later. <laughs> Toby, MVB builder, is about to officially open Suey 2. Please, sir, uh, I'm in the queuing up for weeks. This is so sick that we've managed to build something that's going to last after this video's gone. Oi, right, good job, lads. Well played. Welcome to opening C2. Enjoy. Yes, lads. How you doing? You good? Let's see what you're saying. We've tested it. We've tested it. Yeah. What the hell? Let's get over ourselves. Yeah, it's absolutely foul. We're gonna get used to trusting it. But it's yeah, gonna it's gonna take a while. a while. We've put in more boards on like underneath so the cracks and shit don't split. Yeah. Are you alright? Yeah. I actually spotted the, the corner. I was like, I thought I'm gonna fucking break my leg or something. I was literally like, yeah, you did well. <laughs> Oh. That's what we like, community contributing. Yes. Not bring your own booze, yeah. bring your own crates. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, oh, we're cooking, we're brewing. We love that. Oh, yes, Ben. Yesterday's join videos left me a bit wounded from them. Like, I hyperextended my elbow and like sprained my wrist. Still got my legs in order. That's so. nice bot. Getting injured. Still using what he's got for a good day of training. Yo. Oh, yeah. Yes, that was sick. I barely saw it because my arm was in the way. Happy with that. Just made contact with the wall a little bit like more on the up rather than the down. It gives you more like control. Yeah. Instead of so getting spat out, you can sort of like choose. Yeah. Ooh, that was there. Close. Threading the needle. Yes. Oh, nice. Oh. 
doesn't seem like it should be solid. They're like hose clips or something. Three's probably solid enough, so let's put fucking ten on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is such a nice final addition. Yeah. Do you know in like good so brick spot, easier. the addition of just the lamp post adds yeah. so many more challenges. No, it's true. That last minute addition last night of that is just like yeah, really quadrupled the challenges that have been done already today. Wrap and hope. There wrap. you go, wrap and hope. The haters in the comments are gonna say that's unsupportive, but are you a structural engineer? You because we are structural engineers now, all right? We f***ing structural engineers. Debate it and we'll destroy you. Debate it and I'll annihilate you. Eviscerate you. <laughs> What a place to learn it. Yeah, isn't it? Like, <laughs> learning it straight over the wall. <laughs> New movements up for grabs all, the, all of a sudden. Lovely. They'll be looking at the big wall run. He said, this run up was so unsafe. It made this stronger, now this challenge has opened up. Yeah. Yes. Nice. Yeah, that's really nice. Yeah, if you just put like a 45 in, 45 out kind of thing. Seventy needs to happen. Oh my god, it's going down, boys. Get them so gas, mate. This is so cool. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yes, sir. This bit, this you always overspin that to so try and slow that down. I can't really come down heavy onto that. Yeah. Oh, later. <laughs> you knew you were going to overspin and you still overspin. Yeah. <laughs> 720. Stung the left ankle a little bit. Okay. Like it would. But Twisting right. into the ground. No, it's minor. <laughs> Barely even a 270. You've literally got like full for ages, like. was now a thing but uh, hasn't been stuck yet so I want to try and get that ticked off. Slowly but surely all the challenges are getting ticked off by this squad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, It's great. Yeah. Oh close. Rain it in. That's coming. to do is just extend. Yes! <laughs> nice! I was like, my God. So sick. Thanks. Nice. Yes. Yes. Joey's upset because I didn't send him a message. Sorry, Joe. You're here now. Though. I, found out I, I knew you were happening. I knew you were coming with Trav anyway. No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. Trav. I thought you were on the chat. Are you not on the chat? The chat. The Brighton chat. No, oh, it's no. getting worse. Yeah, it's getting go. worse. Oh, yes. The bar does feel fucking strong. I think it is. I think so. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I 
I think Trav's done like hundreds of preps down there by the little sides back. Nice Trav, that was calm. Nicely done lad. Cash. <laughs> Yeah, that was a good line. Yeah, yeah, actually. My watch says, my Garmin, my watch tells me that I'm having fun. <laughs> Yeah! Yeah, boy! 